It really makes me feel ugly. It makes me feel dirty. I, I just don't feel confident anymore. I'm, I'm just going to go back to bed on my day off. I'm just, just going to... I, I just don't feel confused the day to day. I feel so depressed. My nose is changing shape day by day. And the blood vessels, I can feel them bursting. The pain is chronic. It's like I've got no face left, it's just all nose. I just hate everything about myself at the moment. Hello. I Hi. hope you don't mind me coming round because I've just been worried about you. I'm still... Come in, come in. Okay. Just recently, I've met a really lovely group of friends. Oh, I can't wait to hear what this is all about. I think I'm going to lose those friends, though, because I'm making so many excuses. It's really affecting my life. And I've not told them why. They must just think I'm being... Well, she don't want to know anymore. I don't feel very ladylike, especially when they say more men get this. Oh, right. And I just feel like a free can. When she stopped coming out at all and really even stopped phoning, I couldn't really work it out. So it was quite a worry, really. Hello, I'm here to see Dr Emma. I'm hoping today that Dr Emma is going to be able to tell me that she's going to be able to help me. It would give me my life back, it would give me my confidence back. I wouldn't feel so ugly and just please God she can. Hi, is it Trish? Yes, hello. Great, come with me. Thank you. Come on in Patricia. Thank you. How are you? Um, a bit depressed today, Aww. as you can see. The redness. I feel like my nose is just growing and growing all over my face, like a clown. And how long have you had this problem for? I would say at least 11 years. OK. But just in the last 18 months, it's this redness that's causing my nose to swell. Is it painful? I'm getting blood vessels breaking mm -hmm. and they kill you. Mm -hmm. It just, you, the pain is excruciating. I don't like the way I feel. I'm usually, I like to go out, I like to meet my friends, but I, I don't want to do that at the moment. Yeah. And it is, it's, it's really destroying me inside. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry it's having such a horrible impact on you. It's just destroying my life. I know. We kind of need to fix that a little bit too. It's more than just the skin on your face that we need to fix. It's kind of how you're viewing yourself, isn't it? OK, right. Well, I'm going to get a magnifying glass so I can get close in there and have a okay. good look. Is that OK? Of course, okay. yeah. OK, keep those wee eyes closed for me. Your nose is hard as a rock, isn't it? Yeah. But it feels a little bit more like a swelling. And you've a beautiful slope to the nose here. But then I can see a little bit more bulk coming at this part. And then we can see really clearly all of these lines of the vessels. OK, Trish, so this most definitely is a rosacea. And rosacea kind of manifests itself in different ways on the skin. The main problem for you, which is the rhinophyma, which just means a thickening change of the nose and becoming redder in colour. Um, as well as the rhinophymatous change, you've also got the kind of papules and pustules on the cheeks. It's almost a bit like a vicious cycle. You've got the redness, which is the inflammation, and you've got the vessels and then that makes more vessels and more inflammation. So it's, it's just repeating itself. Now, my treatment programme for rosacea for your skin does involve you being quite diligent with it. And you can pretty much do it in a couple of minutes um, in the morning and a couple of minutes at night time. Right. You cannot deviate from this, this skin treatment. No. OK? No. The next thing is, is that the tablet themselves will, will start to gradually and slowly bring down the bulk and start to switch this process off and then reverse the process. And then the last thing I need to do is use my lasers on you to get rid of the 
vessels and the background redness, which is the most satisfying thing that Maudie and I just, <laughs> yeah. we dream of doing. <laughs> oh, this is just wonderful. Is that OK? Thank you so much. Trish, you know, she was so upset at how this was affecting her. Um, what's really been happening is, is the rosacea that she has has been becoming more out of control, and she's now developed quite an obvious rhinophyma. I'll get back to my life again. Yeah, I know. I'm, I want to get back to your life. <laughs> So first of all, to try and calm the skin as much as possible, I need to give her some cream to try and control things. But creams are just not going to be enough to cut this, and you need to have something by mouth. And then I need to give her some laser treatment, because the only way to get rid of the redness and the only way to get rid of the vessels is to use a pulsed dye laser. Now I've come out of there a different person, because I've got hope and I'm just over the moon. It's just like a miracle. I've now got my cream for my face. So I first met Trish and diagnosed her with rhinophyma, which is a form of rosacea. This is just to take um, the redness down. So she's been started on a medication to try and help regain the symmetry and make it a bit smaller. One, two, three, well done. And then also I'm using some intense pulse light to complement it. That's the vessel wall just destroyed. And she's had two sessions of that. So things are doing really well. Yeah, that one's definitely dead at that side. <laughs> I'm a bit swollen at the moment where I've just had the procedure, but um, I'm gaining a lot more confidence um, every day. Hi, I'm here to see Dr Emma. Sure, what was name? It's Trish. I'm really excited to show Dr Emma today because um, it's been a few weeks now and she will see the difference herself. I can't wait for her to see it. Hi, you Trish. Hi. Nice to see you. Oh, lovely to see Come you. With me. New dress, new hair. Yes, new dress, new hair. This is the catwalk. More confidence. Come and have a seat just up on the bed. OK. So, first of all, Trish, do you have any makeup on? No makeup on at all. Who no would have thought I would have come out without makeup on? <laughs> it's amazing. It is. It was mauve. Yeah. It was and mauve. It was, it was mauve. And the shape was really odd. Yeah. And I just felt like I didn't want to go anywhere or do anything. And now. That moveness is gone. Yeah. And I just I just feel like a different person. Let's have a little look. Wow. You've actually got the shape of your nose back. Look at your cheeks. That is just fantastic. What I think is really most striking is the um, profile of the nose returned again. Whereas this was all bulky out at the side. It was. I need to see you for probably about another two or three laser treatments. OK. Where I'm going to be completely happy with it. Yes. You're using the right creams, you've got the right medicines. Yes. And then hopefully this is never going to come back oh, and bother you again. Wonderful. Honestly, you look brilliant. Absolutely oh, I brilliant. Feel, I feel great.